Hey folks, I did a search the other day when I was trying to build some chairs for a uh, spool, wood spool chairs. These are just wire spools. Uh, and couldn't find a video on any of them, so I figured I'd make one. These are the two that I made. They're all uh, out of the spool itself and one 2 by 4 which was out of my coal wood stack. They're very sturdy. We'll put you all on a tripod here. The tripod's not working right. <laughs> we'll see if that's going to work. Very sturdy. They don't rock. This one's a little smaller. Very sturdy stuff. And all that's built out of one spool a piece. Uh, the slats here are actually the uh, slats off the smaller spool, and these smaller slats off this one are off the bigger spool. As you can see on here, on one I haven't taken apart yet, the bigger slats on the smaller ones, smaller slats on the bigger one. I just reversed them because it fit right. And they have just a little bit of a taper on the top of them. So they round it off. It'd be good for outdoor chairs after I put the poly on them. I don't know if you can see this or not. You can see how it's, it's rounded just a little bit. I think it turned out pretty good. Let me know what y'all think. I built these two for uh, Christmas presents. And as you can see down here, they, uh, they got set with the lives of the 2x4 out of my cold wood stock. Same over here on this one. And I just covered it up. Still got the writing on there. I wish I would have thought about the writing before. I cut the flat on the bottom and put that on the top. Like I had on this one. Put some polyurethane over that and that's going to look good, I think. These would be just sitting out on a deck. I just love to stare on that one just to be funny. If I can pull it off. Uh, I'll probably pull it off so we probably hear it in it. But if y'all got a place where you can get some of these, get out there and make a few. I got four of them in my truck. Uh, next time I go get some, I'm going to take the tools with me. And uh, what I'll do is just take the four bolts out, collapse that spool, collapse that spool right there. And uh, same with this one. Take the bolts out and collapse the spool. That way I could be able to get about 10 of them in the truck. And one mix of chair with an extra 2x4. I just want to put that out there. I've, I'm working on one that uh, I'm going to put these pieces I cut off the bottom on the sides for a little table, a little end table hold your drink or something. I didn't like them on these and these are already gone. These were made for Christmas gifts, like I said. And uh, they're going to have a table that matches them. I'll get a video of that when I build it. And I'll get a video after we polyurethane them. I just wanted to go ahead and get a video up. All I did is if anybody wants to make them, put your two by fours, one here and one on the bottom of the seat, right over here. I screwed through the, the spool into the two by four, top and bottom, and then uh, just attached your your seats 
and I put an extra 2 by 4 right here, as you can see, and I put another one on the bottom down there, just for structure, make sure it didn't rock or anything. So let me know what you think, and uh, we'll get back to you on another project very short. One more shot of them. I'll try to put a picture on here, but I'm not sure if I can do that with my phone. Talk to y'all later. Merry Christmas.